constantly display your masculinity and if you need to basically be in such a shape that you can take off your shirt without embarrassment. More physically able. Being muscular and like hanging, like doing sports, hang out with the girls and stuff. Tall, powerful and strong. I think Hong Kong um, connotes something about um, men being really sporty. It, it also shows some part of like masculinity being Aggressive. That masculinity means a good body. Essentially, just a bit stronger, I suppose. Like not in terms of like the body, although they did all have six packs, but being like having a stronger personality and a harder personality. Gentlemanly. I think masculinity is not about just your physique and like just what you do, but really about your personality and your character. Um, for me, I think it's still expected that, that for men to, to protect a woman at times. I think uh, gentlemanly, not only his physical traits are, but also um, his psychological traits, like he's more possessive. The way they speak, use of language, vocabulary. Like when I'm talking to friends, yeah. Or have you been called back yourself? Huh? I have been called gay, like like for fun, and I've called other people gay also, like for fun, like my friends call them gay. Or <laughs> what? And, but if someone who you do not know and seems to be carrying a very solemn attitude towards this issue, then maybe, yeah, maybe you're doing something wrong in your life. Maybe when you're being too affectionate towards the opposite, to your own similar gender, you're doing things that actually make people uncomfortable. Um, to me, it feels like uh, a check and balance uh, so that I don't go cross the line. So I feel that it should still be there. Oh, really? What do you mean by cross the line? Um, because there are still some things that we, we still should not do. Right? Like maybe the, the way people gesture or like the, their gestures or their way of speech or their dress sex dressing. I, if they, I don't know, like it, it becomes a point where just anything they do is like if they, they screw up or something and you just call them like, we call them gay. Because it's, because since, since we come from a boys school, I think it's, it's against what we usually follow in a boys school. So if, if a certain action is against what we think is norm, then we just call it gay. 